Hey guys, it's Woody Mark here, coming with a brand new episode of my Road to 100 Goals, where we try to get Mr. Luke Revy to 100 Goals. He is on 91 right now, so he is rocking and rolling as usual, and yeah, um, another four game episode, I believe today. We are in Division 3, and yeah, like we won our first two games, I believe. This was recorded a while back, I've been um, inactive on the channel recently. Uh, personal reasons, usual stuff, but Loic Remy is on the ball, getting things rocking, but I will try to get uploads back to how they were, if I can, and um, yeah, but Philip Lam on the ball, he gives it into a Bamyang, and yep, good intersection there, and I thought I'd try to trick you guys with the um, gameplay, because at times it can be easy to see who scores, but like, th this was a great goal right here. Like Remy, finesse into corner. I did some great skill moves, and yeah, when I hop back onto FIFA, I'm not going to be good. I haven't played in, oh, almost a week, maybe a week. I, I don't know, I don't know. But yeah, that's um, goal number 92 for Like Remy. We are 8 of that 100 mark. I've still got to figure out what I did for that, because I believe I did... Um, Victor Obabo's 100 goals um, really well, actually. And in a way, I want to live up to that mark, but at the same time, I want to do something that's different. But it's kind of tough to do the same thing different, if you know what I mean. But Massa gets a lucky goal. It was a pretty good move, actually, in my opinion. But nevertheless, it was a goal. And mute my laptop before I hear that. So, yeah, like very 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 nice plays overall and made this guy rage quit overall i deserve to win and there you go four wins out of four so far that is brilliant but we're going back to our hybrid team and currently with this series what i think i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do big episodes for 100 show all the goals it may be 100 it may not be i don't know and i'm gonna continue to see how high i get in divisions however what will end up happening is I'll end up starting over with a brand new player as um, it's still six months to go into the next FIFA and by then hopefully I'm in a way I want to get two more in but it might only be one I don't know but Kabai does a nice finesse shot um, he has a nice finesse shot but he doesn't get to use it too much but Griezmann good born to Clichy and yeah just here like, got a bit lucky there, however, I'm running with him, running with him, and it's very 50-50, Moreno Mar isn't the fastest or the strongest, I got past him there, here I wasn't going anywhere, he sl slid in, and I got the penalty for it, so, overall, that goal, well, it, I'm gonna score the penalty with Kavai, I'll <laughs> spoil that already, but, overall, that move was kind of like, uh, there was, n it was very cheap from his point of view, because, I got a chance out of nothing pretty much. I, I ran into the box. I was going nowhere. I was going to end up passing around the box. Something may have happened. You never know. But it's unlikely. But goodbye. And he just goes. Bang. In the middle. But my advice would be. If you're unsure where they're going to go. Just go down the middle. Because most likely it will go in. Because if you're like positive and think go to the right, go to the right. However, if you're like, oh, where do I go? Left, right, left, right. Just go middle. Because that's probably where they're not gonna go in my opinion but <clears throat> Kiva punctures it out and like this, this was beautiful by Griezmann into Remy and yeah I'm just um holding the ball seeing if I can get anywhere and Griezmann's a very very tricky player and by that I mean he can he's got very good control and he can like just dribble past players and that was a really really nice goal if he was right footed he would be a lot better maybe an extra um, pace grade or something would make him even better but overall he's a very good player and yep this guy ends up rage quitting too so we've had two in a row in div 3 and when you get up to div 4 div 3 it begins to get difficult so the fact that I've actually won 5 out of 5 I find to be quite an opportunity accomplishment however this guy if you look at sucker griezmann you and d sucker griezmann you probably understand what he was saying to me even though he was only involved in one of the goals so i think he was pretty mad about that last goal to be honest which people get and yeah i did google translate them it's how he learned for languages guys um but a pretty neat 
side, to be honest. That's a pretty good side. However, into Moreno, um, 40th minutes, and I don't I forget what's happened because it's been so long since I've played um, these matches. So I don't I'm just going along with it. But I do, I'm dribbling well with the ball, and I actually do a through ball across goal, which maybe I should try out more. Like, it might be something I fiddle with because I know in next gen it's very, very effective, actually. But in this game, I don't see many people do it per se. So I'm sort of like, is it that effective? Probably not. But corner, um, again, I clear it. If you're unsure on how to defend corners, just press circle because it'll most likely um, be effective. But this skill move was really clever by me. That was completely on purpose. And yeah, pace abuser, of course. I'm sorry to say, yeah. <laughs> Like Remy with the pace, that's how he scored that goal. But that skill move was very, very good. Like, you guys will probably think it's not that good, but it was actually really, really clever. But Robin, in the ball, on, in the ball, I hope he isn't. Um, but Alberto Moreno on the ball. And here I'm sort of looking at options. Schurler was up the field more than, more... Well, he wasn't exactly back to support, so I had to sort of do a long ball. But here, I thought it was quite late on. If I just do an over-the-top through ball into the corner and stick it to the corner, he's not going to be able to pull off the greatest counter. And he bit on a few balls, and that was a really nice skill move and a really nice goal by Kevin Morales. One of the best goals, um, well, the best goal in this... Ep oh, no, I actually like Lloyd Remy's goal more, but that was a really, really nice goal, like just a skill move, the finesse, and... Kevin Morales is very good. He's my go-to right mid. Like, him and Willian are probably the best, in my opinion. Obviously, I haven't tried out Sanchez yet. So, I... But based on cheap options, those two are the best. Like, get get them, get them. Like, Kevin Morales' dribbling is sensational. That's why I love him so much. Where, in comparison to Griezmann, he's fast, he's got good dribbling. But his pace and dribbling stat is a little bit lower. But that was, like, a reckless challenge, and, yeah, that was David Luiz, to be fair, and this, like, okay, the thing I'll say about this guy is attribute cards, and the other thing I'll be saying is, after this goal, I will be upgrading Joe Hart in the next episode, getting his upgraded version, as <clears throat> I've been using his upgraded version, and it seems better, because if you look, you think, wow, what a free kick kind of thing. And then, when you look over it, you begin to think, hold on a second, was that free kick really that good? Because, well, watch the replay a second, once this guy does the longest celebration. If you look, watch this replay, it was pretty much in the middle. It was closer to the middle than it was the corner. So it was actually horrific, say, from Joe Hart. Like, you could argue, oh, he could have been blinded. Well, it's down to him, positioning-wise, for him not to be blinded. And that just hit the face and went in. Like, those never go in. But it managed to go in. So, I, I can't say much, to be honest. Like, yeah. It's one in 100 kind of thing. Because I was just unlucky, to be honest. It was a good shot. I'll say, but it's rather unlucky. And here, at times with kickoffs, I just get very hasty and rush, where at times I just need to pass it around. However, in a way, I want to get the goal, so I get the tackle here. However, I did, I, like, that pass was horrific. You could tell I was a little bit flustered. And if you're feeling a bit flustered, just take your time. I would say just pass it around, because when you got the ball, they can't immediately get a goal back. So you've got to think of it that way at times. However, at times with my mentality, it's like, I will actually just pass it around kind of thing. Well, just go for the comeback goal straight away rather than, like, pass it around. So, but yeah, on the ball now. And that could have been three in a row. That could have been pretty bad, to be honest. But like I said, on the ball into Remy. And here, as you see, I'm sort of taking my time a little bit more, I guess. Like, I'm like... Mm, well, I don't know. I don't think I am because I'm still going for the skill moves and all of that. I'm trying to stay positive in a way. But David Luis on the ball, good tackle. And Lacazette into Remy, really good ball into Remy and he controls it and he finishes it. But I'm going to end the video now, so have a shot it. Make sure you smack that like button, subscribe, so below and do subscribe if you want to see more. It's been Woodmark Mouth here. See you guys.